An issue with the Airstream that I've seen asked about quite a bit lately is concerning the Airstream steps. Put your steps out one day, step down on them, and they give like that. You try to lock that into place and it just won't go. Pretty annoying. We had this happen to us and the fix is really a lot simpler than you might think it would be. Today I'm bringing you an excerpt from our trip to Morro Bay, California in which I repaired our broken Airstream steps and uh, hopefully you find something in here that you can use. Turn on camera. The lick of the lens there. Okay. Where were we when this fell out? Do you remember? Somewhere in, on that Utah trip, right? <laughs> Fillmore? Um, yeah, it was probably that day that the, that the tire fell off and... And the water overflowed. I don't you lost your phone. Anyway, we put the steps out and they didn't come out. They did that. They just kind of half came out. Greta couldn't get out of the Airstream. We didn't know what to do. We didn't know what was going on. So um, it had been a day. But we stopped, looked under, and you'll see there's a bolt. It comes in from the back side and comes out here. And that was not on this side, and that's why it was flopping around. So the bolt goes in there, sticks out from here, and it catches on that thing right there. And that's how the stairs catch. So I did some looking around, some flashlighting, trying to find it, and the bolt had come out and fallen in under here. This part there. So I was able to take these rivets off. and pound around on that until I got the bolt out and it looks like it looks like this so that comes in from that side the bigger part here catches on this has happened to other air streamers and their fix has been to cut a hole under there so that they can get that um, bolt back inside I was lucky enough to find it I know others have not been that lucky so I am going to some tin snips that I had to go buy and just cut along here enough that I can peel these back and get my hand up in there and then I will fold them back down and put a couple more rivets right there to hold everything together. Seems simple enough, doesn't it? Alright, so the goal is to cut there so we can get up in into there. There, 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 there. Here, 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 Let's see, Let's see what we're doing. Okay. So we will, uh, I hate doing this, but here we go. Cut, cut, cut. Uh, that doesn't hurt. That hurts my heart to cut the airstream. So that should, let me get my hand up in there enough. Why are you tipping over? Okay, so that's cut back like that. Hopefully we'll be able to get my hand in there, get that bolt going. I'm putting some uh, thread lock on once I know that it's going to work. And then we're going to bring it in from this side. But using this other hand because it's easier that way. I've had better times. Recently? Yes. So this is a 7.32nds hex. I bought one because all my sets are not only at home, but they're they're all attached to a bigger piece. So let's see if we can get that in there. Alright. So, fold that back up. That back up. And again, we'll need to uh, Drill some holes there, put some rivets in to hold that up, and then we'll figure out how to bond that back together here. Still, nice, right? 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 
that's the fix right there. Wasn't that fun? Well, Cindy's out here taking care of some groom and I'm gonna finish up this repair under here. The rivets didn't work in there. I don't have the right size rivets. So I just put some, some screws in, some metal screws like that to hold those up. I need to drill a hole, holes right there and bring these two together. Cindy jokingly said, too bad you don't have a Mountain Dew can. And I said, well, that would be perfect because I'm just putting tin here. Right? Right. Perfect. All right. Let's get under there and drill some holes. Maybe the back story. What back story is that? <laughs> Anytime you need to fix something, you always say you could fix it with bailing wire and a Mountain Dew can. I really could. You could. That That's the terrifying part. That would work great right there. I could probably get away with some twine if I didn't have any bailing wire. All right, holes are drilled here and here. Just pull those right up together like that. It's pretty good. It's actually, I'm not even mad. That's amazing. <laughs> pretty good, and then we'll clean that off and put something over it later. What did we do last Thanksgiving? We went to Breezy's, or to Fawn and Dave's, right? Was it? Yeah. Why did we go to Easter dinner? Oh, okay. Then no. Okay, so with those in, you can see there's a little bit of a gap there. I could tighten that in, but um, I'm gonna call that good because there's, you know, there's gaps and holes and things and it's all dirty under there anyway. So it stays together. Not gonna cut anybody, and the steps work. That's the most important part, is the steps work. So there you go. Hopefully I don't have to do the same thing on that side ever. But I know how. I hope this never happens to you, but if it does, now you know the fix. If this was any use for you at all, or if you found something you liked or didn't like, leave a comment, let me know what you think, and do us a favor, like, subscribe, it really helps us out when this uh, channel gets promoted. Tell your friends, anybody that you know that might be dealing with a Airstream step issue, this is one way to fix it. Watch your step, and we'll see you on the road.